has been nearly 22 years since the bodyguard turned Whitney Houston into a movie star. Well, now comes a film that reminds us a lot of that one. It's called Beyond the Lights, and it stars Gugu and Batterall in a role that is kind of like Whitney meets Rihanna. And we talked about that when Gugu visited our set. Congratulations on the movie Beyond the Lights. And a lot of people are comparing it to The Bodyguard with Whitney Houston and Kevin Costner, which is quite the compliment because everybody loved that movie. How do you feel about the comparison? Wow, well, that's that's cool. Um, I, You know, I was quite young when The Bodyguard came out, and I think that the cool thing about Beyond the Lights is that it, even though it's set in the music industry, it's very much of our time now. The comparisons aren't far off. Both films are love stories, and both singers are saved by men who see them for more than their sexy persona they feel pressure to put on. Can you look at me for a second? No, wait! I see you. You were screaming, I see you. So, just what do you see? You say that you feel like, you know, you are this object, you know, you're this possession. I think every pop diva was, was a seven-year-old girl once, you know, and actually that transformation, um, you know, everybody is talented, but, but what, what do you give away in the process? Noni is supposed to be the girl that every guy wants. We're selling fantasy here. A lot of people are actually comparing your character to Rihanna. Ah, yeah, you know, we, we took a lot of inspiration from her and many other artists, actually. I mean, uh, myself and Gina uh, saw Rihanna live in concert, which was amazing. We also saw Beyonce. But, you know, that whole idea of persona and I think the idea of, you know, if you become this sex symbol, be it the music industry or the movie industry, uh, what happens when the persona takes over, you know? And um, I'm thankful as an actress that I can play a role and then I can sort of take it off and be me. We were very impressed by our own Roxy Diaz, who actually has a, a little piece oh, in yeah. the movie. Yeah. I see that you brought your guardian angel with you, so are you gonna keep her from falling? He's my date. That leads me to ask you if you have a special somebody. In my life real right life? In oh, real I'm life. not telling. <laughs> you're gonna keep it a secret? I'm not telling. You're gonna do what you learn in the movie. Keep the right. real life the real life, right? Exactly. All right, exactly. I can respect that. <laughs> I first met Gugu at Oprah's house. Oh, had fallen in love with Gugu as an actress and her movie, Belle. See if you remember this moment from the luncheon right oh, here. Take a look. Aww. Yes. This is your moment. Since you are Oprah's favorite actress right now, <laughs> pressure to live up to that? You know, just put one foot in front of the other and, and try and do projects that inspire me.